lots of problems in the office, and many people are very frustrated with the office, not just me. And they're frustrated with your record. You were arrested by Ed Rendell for vote fraud, and you got reelected. You, I'm sorry, you have your time. I will take my time. You were, you wasted millions of dollars on voting machine parts and got reelected. You have, uh, you, you have, um, you have been accused by a federal judge, a state grand jury, the NAACP, of trying to change results of elections, and you've gotten reelected. People are very frustrated it's with that. It's a lie. It's a lie. He showed me the record. I'd be, glad to show you the, I'd be glad to show you the record. Conference. I'd be glad to show you the record. I'd be glad to show you the record. I have a question. Yes. Um, some of the new ideas mm -hmm. that you want to implement sound wonderful. Mm -hmm. And what I would like to know is, uh, where do you think the money's going to come from to implement these ideas? Because the city is in dire straits and they're cutting budgets everywhere. So where would absolutely. you get the manpower and the money to implement these So, So these absolutely, programs? let me let me tell you. Let me invite it's other people also say. to ask questions. So there are, of course, it's hard to know, given that there's not much information coming out of that office, exactly where one could... Uh, one could save money, but I know a few places. So first of all, first of all, in the printing of street lists, in this day and age, there are many people who would be very glad, not everybody, but many, many, who would be very glad to print them off the internet. And we don't need to be spending as much as we're spending printing street lists in that office. That's one thing. Another thing is that a few years ago, that, please let me answer. Wait, please let me think? answer. I'm sorry. Please, you I am not done answering. Please answer, then you can. Not everybody has internet. Some people are poor. Uh, I'm well aware of that. Okay. And what I said was, not everybody. Okay? Not everybody, but many people, and you save on printing. So another place where the office could save money, a few years ago, uh, the office spent $350,000 on a contract with Danaher to take a website that was not password protected, no, sorry, that was password protected, and make it not password protected. Now, I have, I have managed IT for a company. I know a lot about computers. I have a PhD in math. I studied computer science at Stanford. And if I had been at that table, the city would not have spent, the office would not have spent $350,000 on that job, which is at most a ten dollars or $20,000 job, and that's generous. And I know that that company gave your daughter uh, a, a paying contract a few years back. I understand that. Paying contract. Yeah. Yep. You can. I'll send you the quotes. Yes. I'll send send, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, um, so there's a lot of money that that could be used better, even without any change in the budgeting from the city. Do, does anyone else have a question? What's your view on the? Uh, Drop program in the fact uh, of, el of elected officials participating. In it. I think that that uh, drop for elected officials is outrageous, and I think one of the things that's that's really outrageous about it, and I know that the police and the firefighters are, are very upset actually with Mark Tartaglione and Joan Krajewski for taking it, retiring for a day, and then coming back. So taking the money, promising to, to retire, and not really retiring. Um, and and it's been a real um, it's been a real black eye for the police and the firefighters because since they can't get social security the way other people do that was a real a, a really and is a big part of their retirement funding mechanism and it's been very bad for the rank and file workers in the city of Philadelphia and and it was a scandal that elected officials allowed drop uh, allowed themselves to take drop uh, and. Um, that's what I think about drop. Any other questions? I want to thank Stephanie. Thank you. Thank